Hey travelers, Captain Carmen here. I'm in the bathroom of my stateroom on the Disney Fantasy, and I wanted to make a quick video that talks about the mechanisms for the showers. Um, sounds kind of funny, but a lot of people have asked me about this because they say, I can't figure out how to do it because um, they're actually European fixtures that are on here because the ships are made in Europe. They're made in the shipyards in Europe, and then they come over here to the Caribbean or to you know, the United States or wherever they're being used. So they may be shower features that we're not familiar with um, when it comes to using them. Um, basically, from my experience on the cruises I've been on, they're all about the same. Um, they have a temperature gauge on the one side, and then on the other side is the gauge that controls either the faucet water or the water that comes out of the shower head or the sh rain shower handle, whatever's attached. Um, the button here will allow you to move it. Now keep in mind that the temperature is always going to be in numbers, usually 28 to 30 up to 38. Um, it's all uh, Celsius or centigrade. Um, it goes all the way up to 42 and then there's a danger sign because it gets to be extremely, extremely hot. Um, there's a little hash mark on this one that's hard to see unfortunately because of metallic. Um, that hash mark shows uh, probably around 36 or 35, something like that. It's an optimal temperature and it's very comfortable for taking a shower. So I'm just going to leave it there. But if you want to move it, you have to press this little button. I'm just going to leave it there. And on the other side, it's got the off button. It actually says off and it lines up with this little dot. I don't know if you can see that or not. And then you can see the numbers over here. So on this side, what you're gonna do is you press the button and I'm gonna pull it towards me. Let me hold it down. And that's turning on the water, obviously out of the faucet. If I pull it further towards me more, it's gonna get stronger. Some people think, oh, that's all the way it goes pull all the way. Then they get confused not knowing how to turn on the shower. So what you have to do is go back to the off position and I'm going to have to maneuver myself quickly because it's going to go to the shower. So I'm going to back up. You turn it to the other direction and then you have the shower. And then there's the mechanism here. Just move that. That slides it up and down or it might switch it to a rain shower because a lot of the cruise ships have that in there. So, I'm going to turn this off. So there you go. It's pretty simple, straightforward how to use it. Um, just a little tidbit in case you have a question on how to use a European shower next time you're on one of your cruises. All right, I'll see you in the next one, folks. Bye. Thanks for watching. If you like the information in this video, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up and like it. Um, and if you want to make sure you don't miss out on any future information, go ahead and consider subscribing or hit the notification bell. And that way you'll be in the know when I upload some new travel content. And if you have any comments or questions, put them down below. I'll make sure to answer them. Remember, the captain's here to help you out with all your travel needs. We are going to travel again soon. Stay positive. I'll see you next time. Bye.